yeah. The burning roots are invisible too. So to stay safe, keep your feet on something that doesn't burn, like cement or water. Ah, so that's why I would, what was that noise? So that's why I was caught fire early last time. I saw a time. pond on the foot. What? What? It's your fucking goat god furry thing. The woman, the thing itself is back. Play this game like probably a week. Nah, not even a week. Maybe like two or three weeks. Look, I don't think I was. All right, before I do, I'm gonna make sure if I can do it right. Honestly, I thought I was gonna be done with this game. But I don't know. I'm bit... oh, wait, 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 what? Did I not get? Wait, I thought I got it. Bad end. Okay. I did get it. It's right here. Wait. No, it's just chapter two. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. I mean, that's chapter one up there. Chapter two is right here. I thought I got it. Survive the labyrinth? Alright, I'm gonna try and figure out I can do this on my own. Nope. I looked a piece of it up, but I don't I didn't really see the whole thing. So the person went over here. What? These these are all telling my thought Auntie Nana have been leaving me? She's been adding one for every time I lost Bullshit! I remember only died like once! This long sack of shit, you dumb feline piece of bitch. What the fuck is this? Fucking lion ass cat? These are all tally marks and yeah, yeah, me of my ass. Wow, look at all the times I've kicked the bucket, which are false. I only kicked the bucket once. Lying fuck. Jeez, I had no idea. I actually just kind of loud. Let me turn it down a little for my headset. Jeez, I had no idea. I've died so many times, and yet I'm still here. Wait, that's it. If I show this to Billy, I might make it off. No, what? How's I gonna? What is I gonna prove? That's like that's like saying Santa Claus is real, and your evidence is showing fucking a box of cookies. Like what? I should wait here. A few moments later. You want me to go downstairs? You want me to press on it, or you like legitimately just stay here? A few minutes later. Oh, okay, no, you're just getting closer. A few inches later. Take your time. Do I? Do I just go downstairs? Or do you actually expect me to? Twelve seconds later. Okay. Um, I'm a, I'm like damn near close to clicking on it. I ain't gonna lie. What are you doing? Don't tell me you've given up. No. Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. You broke your arm. That shit was crazy. Oh, did they break your arm? No. I'm a fucking awesome. Huh? Wow. What? Ah, it really is broken. How am I going to make it out of this battle? I won't let an unfair advantage hollow my victory. No, stop! What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh yeah, you're fucking crazy. It was clear what would happen if I caught you. There is no dishonor in killing you now. Uh, it kind of does. There is. Actually, actually, can I prove I'm stronger than you? Right here, right now, without oh shit, I sure haven't been in a while since so I read some shit. I gotta speak a little louder without throwing a single punch. Take a look. You're bluffing. Is this some kind of a trap you set for me? I don't need traps to beat you. You were literally wearing a fucking animal skull, you damn furry. Yiff in hell, you fur licker dicker. Not a trap, a scoreboard. Score? Yeah, oh, I see what she's doing. A 12 foot tall cat girl in high heels from outer space carved these notches into the. Well, why would you tell her that? Man, I would have said something cooler. Like, a 12 foot cat girl in high heels from space 
I mean, I guess they're immortal from a fucking cult. I guess it can be believable to them. All right, come on. Oh my god, she's brain. She's dumping it in a sack of air. Really? I haven't already lost you. That makes sense to you so far. To you so far. I work for a cult that worships a four-eyed goat tree from outer space. Your story really isn't outside the realm of uh, believability. Go on. Oh, okay. Well, that uh, makes sense. Uh, she made these notches because she wanted to discourage me. She makes a permanent tally mark of all on the wall each time you kill me. You left this to prove I'll only lose against you. But actually, it's the only way I could have ever proven I won. So, I've beaten you to death countless times? That's your point? You went? You dumb motherfucker, you... Oh, let me let me let you cook. Let him cook! My point is that my technicality... My tendencies is infinite. All of these times I've lost, and, the, and you're not any close to defeating me. You see, right? This may be the number of times I've fallen, but also, it's the number of times I've come back. Oh, you're telling the truth, aren't you? I mean, I guess that kind of makes sense. I mean, you, if you keep killing, you can keep doing this over and over and over, so I, I guess. However, all you've proven is that we're in a stalemate. If you really believed I'd spare you because we're tied at the moment, <laughs> I'm sorry to say, you still have to die. She was gonna kill me until like a like some kind of like plot armor MacGuffin's gonna save me. Your personal honor code means you only listen to someone that's stronger than you, right? And you listen to Buck. That means that must mean that he's stronger than you because he's a more. Even if I manage to break him in two now, he could beat me the next time we met by already knowing what I was gonna do. Ah, uh, makes him stronger than me. I see what she do, but he'd be he'd be worse for fear. I mean, where, right? He keeps the mental and physical trauma from all of your previous attempts to kill me, and I don't. I come back for good as soon as every time without every even remembering how I got my head handed to me. <laughs> if Buck and I fought. I would eventually win because he his injuries would accumulate and mine wouldn't. That makes me stronger than Buck, which makes me stronger than you. Yeah, I don't care about the muscles. Billy kind of bad. I ain't gonna lie. Well, what does she think? <laughs> oh, proving you're stronger than me without throwing a single punch. Does that hurt? <laughs> You move your I'll arm around. You anymore if you spare me. Spare. What? You can't just say that after what? Oh man, Billy, come on. You, you ruined your 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 aura. Spare. Gee, she really does believe I'm much stronger than her. I mean, I guess I was telling the truth, but I didn't expect her to submit like this. She must take the honor code of her seriously. It's a deal. On two conditions. What's the first one. Take off that mask. Second one, lead the furry community. This shit's not it. Why the fuck did she join the furry community? Wait, that shit's just don't even make sense. Could you maybe take off your mask? Oh! I don't have this, this. Oh, the sacramental stair? No, I'm not one of the thousand. I'm not even from here either. And she's she's kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie, she's kind of bad. Man, you can break my back anytime you want. Oh shit! So, what? What's the second order? Marry me. Once I finish our uprooting rituals to set uh, Roxanne free, I want to ex I want to escape uh, escape alive with the book. Done. Really? E easy as that? That's but be word. warned. When Buck sees me helping you, there's no way he'll let me meet you again in the next life. I'll either be dead or somewhere far, far away. Oh man, he's always killing the baddies, bro. The baddies. If I do this, this is the only time I'll be able to help you. This reality is your only shot. Oh my god. So this is the only time I'll be able to count on Billy? I better make it count. All right. Once I finish the last ritual, we're going. Good answer. I'll watch your room until then. Nah, I want to see Billy, 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 Billy. You got nothing to say? I mean, Billy's in here now. Oh no, she's not. 
Aww. I wanted to see Billy. Oh. Damn, in this angle, she's kind of better. What the fuck? Hey, I was wondering, what exactly is your arm? How long do you have? We're surrounded by a thousand people that want me I'll dead. give you the short version then. I only listen to people stronger than me. For example, I don't follow any law written by somebody who benches less than 415. Damn! God damn. Um, <laughs> shit. Yeah, I want to stand a chance. Fuck it. Isn't that basically all of them, though? Yeah. If some dusty old fart could force me to return my shopping carts in person, why do I have to do it because of a law they wrote while wearing a dress? Damn. I don't know. It's not illegal to not return your shopping really? carts. It's not? No. Wait, yeah, it is. I'm looking that up. Hold up. It is not illegal to abandon your shopping cart. Oh. Oh. Okay. No, but it's kind of weird that you... You don't anyways. You can't move a shopping cart from one end of the parking lot to the other. I owe you nothing. So, um, were you always like this? Mean? I mean, were you just running around with a baseball bat before you got abducted? Yeah. Really? Yeah. What's that like? You no. know? I did odd jobs like farm work. That's just for solving problems along the way. It's a weird flex, but... And I was lured here and trapped in this town. Same as you. I crossed paths with Bob, and I got stuck as their de facto hatchet man. Huh. So, you're a pushover. But then you popped up. Someone that single-handedly escaped the thousand. Sending Buck, running with his tail between his legs. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty fucking awesome. You're someone with blood that's worth bottling. Someone who can give Buck mean? and his goons what's been coming to him. What does that even mean? That is the kind of person I've been waiting to take orders from for a long time. You got issues. Ah, She's bad, though. I don't care. Let's head on down. I thought you were going to stay right. here. Be on guard. Buck might be surveilling us. Oh, mm -hmm. I thought. So what? You just right next to me forever? No. Or are you gonna be up there for now? Okay. What was the point of her saying she's gonna look out for the room then? What do I need to do? Oh yeah. You right next to me, Billy? No. Yeah, what is it? Wait! Don't! Not yet! God, I forgot about this dog. I don't, leave me alone. I don't want to go. Tough shit. I want to go. I can't ask you to do that. What? Right. Is there anything? No, Billy isn't going to change anything? Okay. Okay. Um, F, F, Mars, Larf, Dingleberry, N, Frog, Incognito, Wing, Shang, Wing, Ding, Ding, Dong. Thank you. The Black Woods are burning. Buck probably knows now. This is our one shot. Damn, Billy, kind of bad. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> what was that? This is goodbye, fucking um, Billy and Roxanne. I'm, I'm just not gonna be goodbye for Roxanne. I still can't believe she won't do shit. Like, seriously, you gotta. You're a goat god and you can't do shit. No, you won't do shit. All right, what's the plan? Can you get us out yes. of here? Remember that the thousand formed a perimeter around the house. If we run out blindly, we're finished. Oh, yeah. The burning roots are invisible, too. So, to stay safe, keep your feet on something that doesn't burn, like cement or water. Ah, so that's why I would, What was that noise? That's why I was caught fire last time. I saw a time. pond on the foot. What? What? No! Billy! It's Buck. Where is he? Wait, no. Billy! You son of a bitch. You took away my, the only baddie I liked. Well, besides the tan girl, she was alright. Only because they were fucking at you trying to kill me. She was hot. Billy, you son of a bitch, I kill you! Not Billy, fucking. What was his name again? I forgot you. You're so forgettable, you lame ass villain. 
I'll avenge you, Billy. I'm just gonna leave her. Leave her? Bastards. Oh. Thank God that missed. Oh. I turn around to see Buck silently loading another shell into his shotgun. Man, you better. You better. That must hurt. Why is he burned already? My skin isn't falling off like his. What happened to you? Did. Nanny happened to. Who Nanny again? Uh, I remember that. Nanny. I heard that name. That was someone who helped me escape. Where is she? she? trusted. So she's gone this time. No, Nanny! Wait, is your eyes all falling off? I can't really tell. It's a little dark. Nanny's gone next time. No, she's not. I hear her. Now give me the book. Don't bother telling me it's not with you. Because I'm shooting you either way if you don't hand it over right now. Oh. Over my dead body! You're stronger than me now, are you? Fuck you, Billy, do your thing! Use bad attack! <laughs> yes, sir, I knew it, my little JoJo stand. We're poking Yes, sir. Wait a minute. Is if Buck's damage still stays the same? And accumulates. Don't that mean every time they Buck and Billy fight, and Billy wins that fight, he comes back weaker and weaker? It, am I not seeing the picture? Or did I get that right? Buck, Billy, you're dumb. You're a baddie, but you're dumb. Buck, you're a dumbass too. Fucking idiot, really bringing her into into this. You're dumb. Billy, we gotta get out of here. Uh, oh. As I was saying, hold my rope to your mouth and jump in the pond on your way out. Wait in the water until the fire's burned over. What about you? Go! No! Oh, Billy! I turn rushing out of the door. There's nobody standing between me and the pond. I've made it through this. I take one last oh, look behind. You. No, you won't. Oh, I see that. I knew it. Billy, good job, Billy. Wait, what? Stay tuned. Another episode yeah, I already of saw Sucker this. for Love. Date to die for is coming up. Wait. Huh. Is that the Looks like she was stronger than me after all. You've got your work cut out for you, kid. No. Hey, why are we counting on me all of a sudden? You're gonna the next one's gonna be some lolly girl and some to get their hands lame ass bitch in the wedding scene. Next time on no. Sucker for Love. The lonely devil arrives. But Billy. Now who wants and an Nanny, autograph? I guess. But Billy. Who the fuck is that? Oh, that's Billy. They really killed Billy like that, man. And she had big boobies. But we have left a thousand. She was never with them, technically. We miss you, Billy. Sissy, why is your name fucking Billy though? Like, come on now. I'm gonna call you Roxanne. Nah, the, the goat bitch is Roxanne. I'm gonna call you... Nami. You got the attitude of Nami. Sort of. Something like that. Chapter 999. The Lonely Devil Arrives. And that's it with the baddie girls. I'm with the goat god that keeps sexual harassing me. Back at it again. Damn, I'm kind of bad too. Hold up. <laughs> what? Oh my god, I had a Vietnam flashback. <sighs> okay, uh, the cop. Cast are free of this side. Uh, yeah, I know I pronounced that shit wrong. You know, the squirrels excite me. Such yeah, commotion. Yeah. No matter what all the fuss is about. Lady, you ain't gonna suck my dick. Just go. The day to be causing such a ruckus. Lady, if you're not gonna fucking blow me, then leave. I'm sick and tired of spawning in the fucking light. You'll never see me in a library. I fucking hate books. Boring ass fucking entertainment. Fuck out of here. It's gotta. It's gotten late. Shoot. I was supposed to look for the leaves before show. Oh, I'm good. For a year now, people, most most of the girls have been disappearing. Oh, uh, wait, no, this is different. Have been disappearing. What? How is shit changing? You dumb god. All you gotta do is take the book and never return. Dumb. I've been disappearing from their homes all over. The 
the the prefecture at first everyone thought they just run off together but as more girls vanish without a trace panic starts to spread they're last seen in the bus of sacramento having grown up here i can't just stand by while so many people are going go missing in my backyard yeah you you can you, you really can that's the logical common sense thing to do wait that horde outside sounded like a group of girls i should warn them or very very least follow them follow after them what could be a lead you're not the fucking scooby-doo gang you don't need to do any of this and why do their voices sound familiar they really don't but okay what? don't leave without your books I ain't reading no shits. Get the get that shit out of my face. Hey, get that phone out of my face. What are you talking about? Whoopsie daisy. Almost forgot. Thank you so much. Thank you for stopping in. Take care. Suck my dick. A rush outside, leaving a warm glow at the bookstore behind me. That's a uh, motorcycle. There's no trace of the girls. They should be about where the bus drops off the missing girls. I better hurry and catch up with the group before I lost the church. You're a woman, all right? And the only people that are going missing are women. And you're a woman. Trying to be a white knight and investigate this shit. Man, I could... Man, I thought you were black, but that's a tan right there. You ain't black. It sounded like they were headed into the residential area through... GGI. No, this is definitely different. GG... GGI... Ily? Alley, or is that pronounced different too? Who cares? Where they're chasing after someone? Hmm. Did I make a wrong turn? There's no sign of anyone. I can't hear the commotion anymore either. The fog here is so oppress oppressively thick too. If I keep if I keep note of the missing person posters along the wall, I should be able to find my way. There's only a few of them, so I can use them as markers, because I'm an idiot. Well, maybe I should start talking like that. Was that a footstep? Who's that? Hello? No response. Was the wind too loud for my voice to be heard? Hello? Yo, was that a gun? Yo, I take a step back for, uh, I take a step towards the shapeless shadow in the mist and hear something crackling under my feet. Oh, okay. What the hell am I looking at? What am I... I think it's like a man eating spaghetti? Something wrapped on the construction paper. There's various footprints stomped across the surface. It's a photo of an old man eating spaghetti. I was right. Eating spaghetti messily. It must have just been framed. The glass is broken for being yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't see what's the support. Someone from the group I heard must have dropped this. I sprint after them only to smack right into something else. Like Ow. Oh man, you're not Annie. They, did that guy, did Buck change your gender? Man, I'm, I'm so sad. Oops, I'm really sorry, you fucking fuck boy. Are you okay? Hey, don't sweat it. It was my fault for standing in the middle of the road. Oh, let me help you with your books. Yeah, you can keep them. What a handsome boy. How do you know that? There's a mask on his face, dude. Probably got, like, killer Crocs teeth. I heard that men are going missing, too. Eh. Are you headed for the bus stop? You might have already missed the last one. No, I'm actually looking for clues about those girls that... That have been going missing. Are you trying to find someone, too? I'm looking for my girlfriend. Mm, man, this de that's debatable. Poor thing. Was she part of the mob I heard earlier? What's her name? That depends. What's yours? White people. Ha, bleh. That was so corny. Yeah, this guy's the worst. We. Hey, this may be a strange question, but okay. do you not recognize me? No, I don't recognize fuck boys. Sorry, have we met? I don't usually get faces. Ah, that must be it. You must not have seen me on TV yet. I made that one song, Lonely Devil. And most likely shit, but keep going. Oh wait, I know you. You're Captain Kid, right? The one and only. Ah, uh, you serious? Fucking One Piece Kid? Captain Kid, more like useless mid. <laughs> Lame shit. He's a widely adored local idol that appeared out of this thin air a year ago. No wonder he's wearing that disguise. I bet he can't even go to the store without getting mobbed. Hmm. Still nothing. That's strange. I'm not trying to hook up with you. Fucking loser. Look at the way you dress. You look generic. 
everybody being a little K-pop music video. Who'd you say you were looking for again? John Carter. The girls might have been going missing. You're not looking for me? I don't know who you are. Say, you are an out-of-towner, right? I mean, you obviously don't live here. I'd know who you are. I know everyone around here like family. <laughs> That's fucking lie, but all right. I'm not really out of a towner. I used to live here. It's where I'm staying while I'm looking. Show me. No. If you're really from around here, show me where you live. Okay, see, there you go. That's strike one, two, and three. I feel I dig into, into me from all around. I can't see them. But I can't. But I can't. Ah, fucking damn it. But it. Ch ah, fuck. But it can't just be paranoia. I'm not doing anything, so let's go now. Oh, don't forget your bag. You <gasps> so. You're the one Buck wants. Man, Damon, I knew you were gonna be a fuckboy. Hey, bro, you, you wouldn't just listen to some loser with a shotgun. Come on, man, you're popping with the ladies. Me, personally, if I was popping with the ladies, I'd never listen to some fucking virgin shill. Oh, you're the one I've been looking for all along. I'm suddenly madly in love with you. What the fuck? What, you got fucking bipolar? What the hell? In fact... I know it's so soon, but let's get married to Oh, man, I know what she's doing. I know what he's doing. I knew it. After all, so long as you're alive, I'll never have eyes for anyone else. I, oh. Never. Are you serious? Fuck you. Nah, when I see you again, it's on sight. <laughs> Nigga, did I just see your swords? Killer girls. Why? Why? Like, what What do you gain from this? Like, what do you gain from this? Unseen hand desperately grabs at me from all around, but I managed to shake off their grit with surprisingly, surprising ease and make up. Don't tell me these are little kids. If you're, if you're over here, I swear to God, I kill you and register you as a pedophile. Uh, mad dash forward behind me with a dozen of footsteps. What's going on? Why am I being chased? Who the hell is Buck? Before I knew it, I'd arrive at my ancestral home, sitting ominously along the fog. Yeah, that's like the only thing you want to say. More like your house is burnt damn near to the crisp. You got a bunch of ashes right there, a little bit of here. Okay, let's just get into it. Honestly, what was in my bag that made them all want to chase me so badly? You dumb idiot! You weren't listening, huh? What's this book? The nightmare started over again, and it seems I got lured into the black woods trap yet again. Which means I get to see Roxanne again. Score? Oh God, I'm about to be sexually harassed again. The hell is this shit though? A beautiful, morbid-looking flower. This must be rot bloom. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what to do. Oh, I didn't expect you. Ugh. I mean, the only thing intimidating is a knife. Everything else, you just look dumb. All right. You don't want to, you know, no, she's probably gonna like break the glass. Don't fuck with crazy people. What was that? Um, bye. You just not gonna talk about that? Okay. Where's the stairs? Oh. Up here, too? Maybe this room changed. Nope. No. Absolutely nothing changed. All right. Oh, there's no more doors? How's that fair? I don't got a guitar or anything, too. All right, you know what to do. You know what to do. Come on out. And you added with your dumbass looking smile. There she is. I can stare at her forever. No, I cannot. Hey, Roxanne. You hear her sexual assault harass me again? Perhaps in view of what we've been through together, you could call me Roxy. No. You probably don't remember, but you called me that long ago. No, I didn't. And 
and I've grown Did very I? fond of it. Do you? No, I didn't. You trying to? Again? No. Of course, I'm really glad to see you again, Roxy. <laughs> oh my God. Have uh, you been? Never better. The thousand are at their last gasp. The only two remaining original members are Buck and Kid. Original members? Kid was never original. How the fuck did I not see him? I should have figured that boy met I met was involved. What happened to the rest? Well, every single person Buck sent to kill you instead joined you, time what? and time again. So Buck sees to it that when I dream up a new reality, the traitors don't live to meet you. Aww. Buck sends somebody to kill you. They fall in love with you instead. Because I'm awesome. Buck, reality ends. Buck spends hundreds of years in time out. Dude, just give up. Well, how I'm, I'm I could never wait hundreds of years. Just give up. Then reality starts anew. Buck kills the traitor, then sends somebody else after you. Hundreds of times over. Why am I doing this over and over? Wow, sounds like I'm on fire. Hmm. What is it? I'm not kissing. I've lost you many times as well. Yeah, I know. I left. I left you in your their hands. How many I'm times? Fine, Stardust. Really. Ah, uh, okay. This is all nearly over. Soon, the thousand will just be a distant memory. Can you stop smiling at me like that? Oh <laughs> shit! Roxy, what the fuck was that? You didn't tell me? Roxy, you dumb fuck, I got stabbed! <sighs> Tackles to the ground. This, this sickening sound of wet metal scraping the dull pressure of my stomach. My eyes shoot wide with shock. She's clawing at my clothes and neck, hunting my grip a while, hunting for a grip while we struggle for leverage until eventually, puffing, she collapsed. What happens below? Are you all right? Did you help me? Because if you didn't, then holy shit, I do not like you even more now. I gasped and covered my mouth in horror. It happened so fast. I. What? What do we do? Can we do the, the healing thing? You know, uh, isn't there something with the ritual? Sawdust. He's dead. No, fuck, fuck, no, fuck for me. Not for her, ED, for me. No, I, that's not possible. It was so fast. She was already at death's door from exhaustion and starvation. Falling on her weapon was the final blow that stopped her heart. Wait, I thought I got, I thought I got stabbed. All right. All right. That normally wouldn't even be a serious injury. Chalk it up as another death by exhaustion from the Blackwoods. So I got lucky and you didn't do shit. Thanks, fucking Roxanne. This fat fuck. She's weak because she was about to die. Is that how I escaped from the horde earlier? And if it makes any difference, she had the Sacramento stare. Her conscience was long gone. Mentally, she wasn't here for her death. Because she was weak. She's trying to comfort me. But even if it was in self defense, it feels like I. Mic check. Hey, are you hearing me? That voice. It's the boy from earlier. Sounds like you had a bit of a nasty shock, huh? Buck's had a lot of time to reflect on how you've beaten him. And we've made it so it won't happen again. Oh, please. You don't like what we've done with the place. Let's see here. Number one, we took everything out of that room that we didn't need. No bass guitar, no nothing. You're unarmed. Man, you did that the second time, so what you just said was false. Number two, no door to the ritual room anymore. Nowhere safe. Eh, but you already knew that one. Alright, Roxanne, you're the only god. I'm gonna need you to boss up and help me. Number three, we begin our attack immediately. No negotiations, no honor duels, just last bitch standing from the get-go. I mean, to be fair, you, you sent, like, actual damn near dying people so not really a a problem just like an easy to run or just punch him in the face and they'll probably knock out and die in their exhaustion unconsciousness so it's this is not really a problem number four we cleaned out the fridge as soon as you got here so no ritual reagents for you i'm not gonna lie i'm kind of glad i ain't drinking fucking blood and eating green meat again number five blast loud music to drown out our movements I'm black. I got that fucking black spider instinct. Bro. I don't need that shit. And number six. Burn this list after doing everything on it so she doesn't know what's coming. Dumbass! 
You are dumb as a rock. Oh. Well, here's number five. What do I do? I don't know. This has never happened before. I... Nothing like this. Sounds like they're getting serious. Guess we're gonna have to get serious too. Alright. And I still can't... You got some big boobies, but you're a goat. I'm not into that. <laughs> you little goat feet. Oh, hey, what was that? Give me this. You don't need that no more. I got a knife. Right? How do I use a knife? Emaciated body from the girl that attacked me. She looked even skinnier up close. Poor thing. Eh, fuck her. So. Organs will be liquefied, so any sudden movement will you tragic result. Do not perform any ritual outside or near an open window. Um, what the fuck did you just read? Ah, uh, music kind of going hard. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, so that's what the grass is for. Ah, uh, this should be good. Oh, too fast. Dingleberry Quanis Chicken Wing Dingle Wingle Racism War Babies. Alright, now I... Right, so you gotta wait 72 seconds? Come on now. The music's getting louder and I don't like that. Nah, they're not coming in here. I stay my my bars with that. I'm going on my phone too. That's how that's how much I know they ain't gonna come here. I'm confident they won't. I'm on my phone right now. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, wait. I'm hearing shit. Oh, wait, whoa, oh, I saw that. What do I do with that? She's in here. What do I do with that? Ain't doing anything. I saw that. Can I go in here now? Such a troubled look. Are you alright, my sweet? Don't call me that, but yeah, I'm fine. I'm still really shook up by the one that rushed in. The one that, you yes. know. Death can be an upsetting thing to see for the death shy. What's up with this sexy music? What? Nothing's happening. We're talking about a dead body. It's not that. She's not wearing robes or a mask. She just had the stare. And she was so frail. So on like a thousand. You have already figured it out on your own, haven't you? No. I didn't want you to find out. But your attackers are not members of the Thousand. They're using innocent people as your assailants this time. Sick bastards. This is a concerning bit of leverage they've created. Experience has taught them they can use your humanity against you. Dear God. I mean, it's kind of smart. This feels so, so different from what, like, from what little I can remember. How, how am I supposed to save any of them? Roxanne? I'm gonna call you Roxanne. <sighs> At this point, I know nothing I can say will stop you from trying to befriend the people actively trying to kill you. Oh, you're if not they're okay. under my curse of thousands, then their admiration for Kid has been magnified to the point Useless of fanatical mid, you mean? idolatry. All right. The only way to break their obsession is either by finding something else that they love even more. God damn it, my headset <laughs> fucking died. Hold up, man. The object of their obsession. But I don't know anything about these people. Where would I even start? I hope I think of something. I got it. Every woman likes every woman likes one thing and one thing only. Bitch and complain. Bring up about a man and cheating on you, and they will complain about that. Well, that, well, that's actually a good reason to complain about. But it's not the other person's. All right, everything I need is already in your room. I want to go. What did that even do? 
Find Slation in your location, cheat someone, your organs will be liquefied, so any sudden movement will you try to... Do not perform... Wait. Is there no... Is there an upside to this? What's the point of this? Enhancement Black Eye. Your body should be more pliable to change now. Have a knife on your, your person. Harvest meat from a mammal that died within the black wood within the last 24 s Actually, ah, oh, unfortunate for Stardust. She is not ready for this shit. This works best if something that you personally killed. Chant twice while standing near the partner. Partner, okay. If the ritual was successful, you should be able to see something glued between the next page. If you so, if so, you can now sense the living thing to the verge of death. Your map will be automatically revealed. Okay. Oh. Dingle, dingle. Okay, Goku, Yaku, chicken wing hot dogs. Dinky, stinky, narwhal water bottle. Oh, wait, you want me to cut it first? The meat of something that died within the black woods in the last 24 hours. She's already dead, so there's no harm in this, right? I'll be quick about Okay, you. Alright, you had a problem defending yourself, but you don't have a problem with fucking mutilating the body? That should be enough, but carving up a dead human from their meat. I can't remember enough about myself to know if if I'm better than this. Dog, you're doing this to survive. What? Better? What? The line that separates me from the thousand is getting blurry with every goal. No, there's a difference. You're trying to survive. You're a victim. There, There is no comparison. Dingle, dingle, jingle, taco, wackle, dingle, wingle, narwhal, water, narwhal, bottle. Chicken hot dog, water bottle, chicken wings, boiling. We did, we did, blah, blah, tick tock, mid. Useless mid. Very, very good. It seems we have a fighting chance against their new tactics. Not really. What's this? A portrait of your grandfather? Nope. I don't know who this is. Oh, that's not mine. I found it while I was coming here. I figured one of the people who went missing dropped it. Wait, if somebody went out of their way to, to frame this, they probably care deeply about whoever this in this photo. What if it's one of the people chasing me? If I can reunite this with the owner, maybe I'll they'll realize they love the guy in the photo more than Kid. Really? Brilliant as ever, my shining star. Don't call me that. But be careful and observant. This photo might protect you from its rightful owner, but it'll have no effect on anybody else. Yeah, well, they can, I'm about to plop my balls in their heads. Right. I'll keep an eye out for the other. The other dropped key say like, oh my god, it's gonna be like one of those fucking puzzles not puzzles. Whatever it's called. Alright, you Yeah. Fucking die like a loser you are. Map. Wait, where? You ain't scared. You're a a little girl? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm not listening to a little fucking girl, with, even with a bat. Who was hungry and frail and fucking tired as hell. I'm botting her. You know what? No, come on, go. Oh my god, you are a wuss. I am not losing that fight. Okay, never mind. You scared me. Wait, where's the door? Wait, where's the door? Oh, that's a door. I thought that was a mirror. Enhanced mi organ donor. Having a knife on, a, on your person chance while facing one uh, rat bloom flower. Do not attempt to, this ritual in a room with more than one rat. But every room has that. How, how am I supposed to do that? Let me read the rest. Uh, let's see. Dingle, bingle, bingle. Don't feel too bad if there are wild ones here. Oh, I thought she was gonna. Ah, I see. That's cool. Dude, it's a little girl. Don't. <laughs> You're not gonna lose that fight. I swear to you. Oh, shit. Yeah. What am I supposed to do? I ain't losing that fight. Oh man, you're a bitch. I saw that. I saw that. I'm leaving.
Let's go, Tom. Let's go. You can't even. Ah! Oh, that's right. There's another way to go. So I just up and just ignore her. <laughs> Wait, what is she? What is she like a shice? What is she a social anxiety fucking killer or something? <laughs> she's like that. She's like that one girl. Can't look at her senpai. Okay. So just don't look at her. Wait. Oh, okay. Just don't look at her. Just. Man, kid, a kid who's seeing you right now, he would be fucking mad right now. Quit breathing on my fucking neck. Holy shit. This shit ain't even scary. It's just goofy. Eh. 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 Nah, my senpai. This one is just definitely not my, not my sister's. I've never seen this number of my mom from my mom before. Oh, hold on into it. Maybe I can return it to whoever. Wait. This is going to be stupid before I give it. Try to turn around and give it to her. I'm going to do this. Wait. Nigga, shut up. That's not fair! Oh! I call back the number from the missing calls. I put it on speaker. Erica? Erica! Thank goodness I was worried sick! Oh my. Oh my god, I'm goaded like that. Wait, ain't that. Mama? What happened to you? That is her! Where did you go? The fucking. Why did you leave? Tentacle girl. I'll try to be a better mom. I. You didn't do anything wrong. I'm so sorry. Please don't be mad at me. Sweetie, please come home. Yeah, it's not happening. She's like, I guarantee you, like an hour before dying. I'm coming, Mom. Thank you. I still say I would have literally beat the shit out of you. I give her her phone back and she dashes off. Okay, she has the energy to do that. <laughs> I still say I would have beat her, but I literally... Do not attempt to work for all in the room. Do not feel too bad. If their rock balloons here, they won't be needing their heart anymore. Hopefully, they don't try and take it back. What do I do? I just. Leave Tom Inogognor Rim's father. What? I hope you appreciate the situation you're in. We can do this forever. Tell me who the bookmaker is. Over my dead body! Accommodate that. <sighs> Giving up? Finally. My arms are getting tired. She never breaks. This is a waste of time. We'll have to find leads on our own. She told you she was from here, right? No. Yeah, but I think she was lying. In case she wasn't, check every house. Starting with the ones near our base. Find a photo. Something left behind that proves that she lived there. Okay. What? Oh, that's like dozens of houses, though. I gotta do that all by myself after burying her. <sighs> if it makes you feel any better, this is the worst day of my life, too. Kill yourself. You're not even that cute. Actually, I can't really tell who my gay. Beck wants to know who the bookmaker is and where I live. If he knew either pieces of information, he could find me long before I made this made it to this house, before I know what's going on. If that happened, I'll be all out. Oh my god, it's almost an hour. Oh, redos. I'm going to try try to not think this hard about it. Or about the soft pulsation on my own heart in my hand. Did you say in your hands? Who the fuck is blasting that music? Actually, yeah, you know, where is that at, TV? Right. No, nah, that's an old lady. Bro. Wait. Please come here. Let me kill you. I stand a safe distance away and pulled out a crack portrait I found her. Ooh, what have you got there, dearie? You're like the nicest killer ever. What the fuck? So 
So handsome. That's debatable. Is that my... Is that my Angus? Yeah, Angus Kong eating spaghetti. Why do you have a picture of her eating spaghetti? Oh, that's my Angus. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey, lady, it's okay. You can get the fuck up out of here. Because I'm glad I have this picture because you're about to probably drop my ass with some, like, ancient kung fu shit. Thank you. That was it. I'm not gonna music go hard. Okay, no one. Okay. Okay. What the fuck? Oh shit. There's a silver head on the table. I mean, no testify this hair. No, Billy! Were you, my love? You'll miss this souvenir. The head belongs to one and a half of the pot. You're doing so well despite the circumstances. I know, I'm awesome. I'm proud of you. Shut up. I'm Roxy, but. But what? What's troubling you, my shooting star? Stop. What's up with these weird nicknames, bro? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna smash you. Uh, but I sense the great disturbance in the force. I just saw all the flowers I've left. Each one holds a memory of other times I didn't make it. I wouldn't advise seeing any more echoes of past realities. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Believe me, I've had my fill. But it's just so strange to realize how many times I've gone. Around and around and around. I'm still doing this shit for attorney. You had the ability of a fucking god do something. I was thinking the same thing. To think Buck hasn't given up after all this time. It's strange. I mean, what else can he do? I mean, like... You can do something for some reason you won't. Whenever my followers achieve lifespans so long that it borders on immortality, they usually end their lives within a year. Without the ticking clock, there's no reason to do anything today, tomorrow, this month, ever. I mean, that's somewhat debatable, but alright. Even with my powers, the longest a human has ever chosen to live is 125 years. Buck is thousands of years old now. To think he hasn't gotten tired of this yet. Hmm. That's, a, that's actually, actually interesting. Roxy, it's okay. I've made it to the last virtual game. You're almost out of here. You managed to get through everything. I mean, yeah, it was pretty easy. Ah, well, we kind of phoned it in with the outsourced killers, huh? But they're still useful for just one more thing. Check this out. You're going to love it. Oh, there's nothing I hate more than people that run from burning buildings. If anyone did that, I wouldn't love them anymore. That's sick. That's actually genuinely sick. There's just something so beautiful about someone who could sing their love for me amidst the fires of passion until they drop dead. That's actually really sick. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. You see now, if you uproot the woods, everybody burns. Wow. I'm actually speechless. I'm actually picturing real life. Just wow. Make your choice. That's this game. Turning his fans into into hostages. You sick fuck. Fuck him. I don't care. I can't just give myself up, but I can't send innocent people to the demise. Is there is there a right move? There is a third option. We call me that bitch. And then kill kid. His followers will flee. The object of their lust. I mean, I got a knife, a TV. If I turn it off, you can come back, and I can turn around, and stab him. That could work. Die, let die, or kill. I know these are impossible choices for you. Yo, why are you explaining this while smiling? Make, I'm behind you 100%, my starlight. Stop giving me your weird nicknames. I mean, you're not really sexual harassing me like we did before, but still, it's just weird. Truth is, I can't make any of those choices. They've got me trapped three different ways. I still have a faint hope that being stubborn will see me through this. If 
if I find all the hostages keeps uh, keepsakes, there's a chance I won't be forced to make a choice. Oh my god, there's like four more. I don't want to do that. Can we just kill him? Why don't we just kill him? Like, I don't know, like. Okay. That's really it? I gotta walk around, look for shit. Okay. Maybe the bathtub had something? This music is going hard, I ain't not gonna lie to you. What if there's something in here? What, what in corner? None of these are mine. Alright, so nothing. Wait, I had a head. What the hell am I supposed to do with that? Do I have to look around for shit? Or I just... Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. Number seven. Wait for you to come turn off the music. Turn around! You're not gonna use a knife? Man, this fucker better have some godly powers so you not be able to use a knife. That's bullshit. Wait, there's no good in or bad ending. Aw, oh, man, I'm wasting my time and everything. All right, leave me alone. I present the head of the idol. I present the head of the idol. The idol? How do you know that's an idol? What? Did, how did he get a fuck? Why does he have a head? Why is there stuff in this house, especially a head? Who carries a head around? I feel like even Buck wouldn't do that. that that's sick. I saw you two on TV. Any chance? For a reunion tour? Uh, 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 yeah, she dead. Yeah. What? <laughs> what? Thank you very much. What the fuck? What? They leave harmonizing until they are too far for me to hear. All right. So what is what is what? All right, nothing. Okay. Die, ah, shit! Ah, uh, how? Why didn't I think there's someone gonna be in there? So how do I get past that? Think. Where have I check? Can I gra grab that? Okay, no. 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 I mean, you're into that, maybe. No. Where have I not check? Ooh, the balcony. Yep. Yeah. Muffle head music. I was. I'm such a goaded detective. Nobody's out here like I am, dude. Looks like someone left their CD player here. It's covered in punk stickers. Through the headphones, I can hear an acoustic song playing Silent Hermit. Homemade. Must have belonged to one of the folks hiding out around here. Guess I'll hold on to it. Look around, look around, look around. Look. All right. This is all I'm just gonna do. Found her. Man, she's kinda bad. What the fuck? What's up with all these baddies hanging out with this lame ass fucking fuck boy? I crank the volume as high as possible and it can go and hit play. An acoustic song starts. What is that music? Me, bitch. I know I'm swagging out with the guitar. Your voice. I finally definitely, I definitely got the right person. Don't you recognize who that Wait, is? Wait, I know who that is. That's me. That's my song. That's me. And yeah, your voice is man. I still like Are it. you serious? But it's so good. I I sound like that. I can't hear it, but yeah, okay. It's, I, I can go with that. I give her back her CD player. She quickly puts the headphones That's on. That's really me. She crawls away, nodding her head along with the music. That's it. Ooh. Oh, what? The ID says it belongs to Kenji Aito? It says here he turned 22 today. It should... Either that poor guy's wandering in... That's fucking... What was it? Fuckboy guy's name. 
either my snake or he's with the ones chasing me. I'll hang on to this just in case. Look around one more time. Look around, look around, look around, look around, look around, look around. Okay. I'm not reading, I don't even know what this shit does. Dingleberry, guang guang, bing bing guang guang. And so my black woods burn to ash once more. Looks like I really am leaving again. These dreams with you, so long and so short, and never dull. Nah, it's pretty dull. Same thing, like almost happens all the time. We will meet again, yes? No. I started to grow fond of Sacramento. What? It's a cozy diversion from the outer cosmos. And it kind of feels like my second home. What? I now have absently. My thoughts are preoccupied with what's to come. Did I make the right choice? You told me once. Nothing is worth regret. That's debatable. Memories and lessons are all worthwhile. That's also Your debatable. Your story is still being written. Even if this chapter ends differently than you'd hoped. Yep. I thought that was an insightful thing you said. Is it, am I saying? Where's her voice? Thank you, Roxy. And thank you, my starlight. I'll call me that. Take care. And be good. Okay, goodbye. Alright, make sure. Okay, make sure, make sure, make sure, make sure. I'm leaving. Y'all can't stop me. I got my happy feet on. Look around, look around, look around, look around, look around. We have two more slots. Which means... It's probably gonna... I'm gonna have to find it through... Through a certain direction. Uh, way to fucking go through something, something, yada, yada, yada. I'm not losing this shit. Damn furries. Over here. It's no use. They're too lost in the song. Ah! Oh, no, no, I'm not. I wasn't gonna go back and save them, so. Sucks for you, bro. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll remember you for the next, like, two seconds. I don't even remember your name. So I guess I did a good job of that. I might lose then. There are two more slots. Right? Man, you look like a fuck, boy. Holy shit. <laughs> This motherfucker looking at having his pants out and everything, his underwear out and everything. What is you? You look like a fucking bootleg Twilight character. Your name is probably Luke Angus or some shit. You can probably treat morph into one of those depressed, beat up looking wolves talking about like, you do not want to see the inside of my, my anger is. Once you get me anger, angry when you put me in, ah, I don't know, some shit, I don't know. So, you decided to kill everybody, huh? Or have you come to throw yourself at my feet? You are a loser. Or is this the part where you try to appeal to my better nature? You deserve what comes next if it is. Dude, I'm cutting your throat, bro. You won't even see that shit coming like a ninja, bitch. Did you think you'd miraculously be able to save everyone? Sorry to say, Buck already has you all figured out. Man, you do a lot of yapping. Know that you only have one choice here. Yeah, kill you both. Just hand me that book and then go back inside while the house burns down. Do it, or I'll keep my fans here until they burn. I don't give a fuck. He's not even harmed. He's really that calm. Bro, I'm slitting your fucking throat. Easy like that. I'm slitting your damn throat. Give me the option. Oh, I didn't see the knife. The one that the girl who attacked me would have had. Oh, you got me. <laughs> Almost thought you were going to go full yonder for a second there. But that's just not in your nature, is it? It may not be in Stardust's nature, but sure as hell's mine! I would just walk towards him. Hey. Yeah. Stop messing around. You're not actually gonna use that to Yes, sir. If I remove the object of a the object of a obsession, the rest will flee. That's what Roxanne told me. All the rot blooms I saw. This is practically self-defense, right? Fuck said you wouldn't hurt a fly. No matter what. God, I feel evil right now because I just love this—the face of despair. 
Look at him, scared. You know, he can easily just grab my arm because it's six pack of muscles he works out, but still. Was Buck wrong? Did he lie to me to save himself? You say something! Yeah, you're dead. I stuck closer for once, I'm not playing defensively instead. I, instead of reacting to what they throw at me, I'm in control. Wait. You can't do this to me! I'm finally in my prime! Taking it all away from me now. Uh, you can't make that choice! You whoa, I can! You're right, I can't make that choice. Bruh. What are you doing? Oh my This fucker wants to be Naruto so bad. You about to give him the speech. She's about to give her the speech. What the fuck? I won't do this. Whatever happens to your fans isn't my choice. It's yours. You're the one keeping them here, not me. At the end of the day. I'm just not responsible for all of the pain in the world. And you can't force that responsibility on me. That said, I really do care about what happens to your fans. You and I hope you do what's right. <sighs> oh my fucking god, you're dumb. He's gonna come back! We gotta start all this again! Nabbing by Buck. I leave the house entirely on him. Un un impended? Not even by Buck. The faint singing continues for a while until I can't hear singing anymore. This time I make it as far as the bookstore before. What? What's? What is that? Oh God! What is that? That was W chapter. Ain't nothing. She died. She killed herself. She, she fucking listened to her own voice. Fucking dumbass. Seriously, if there, we had our I'd literally rock her jaw with my face, bro. I swear to God. Is that really it? I guess I'll save you. Might as well do it. What? Number seven. Wait for you to come turn off the music. Wait, no, wait, back up! So, he only spawns there when the dude's there? That don't make sense. I'm not doing all that again. Alright, there you have it. An another chapter done. Alright. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> you stupid! I had to kill that guy. Unsatisfying with that little fuckboy live. Loser. Alright, there you have it. If you like more, you want, like what you saw. Yada yada yada, subscribe, comment, all that. I'm hopping off my butt hurts.